Oh, we're rolling. Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel. We're in the Watkins workshop again. It's a rainy Saturday. It's a very exciting day though. It's new bike day. Well, I've had it a couple of days now, but I've not really done much to it. Uh, yeah, it's exciting, yeah. A couple of years ago, got myself a Van Nicholas Yukon, which is a, a titanium kind of touring, all-weather, all-dax bike. Uh, that was super exciting. 2017, I think that was. We're now in 2019. Since then, I got my fi I got a fixed gear bike off eBay. That was fun. But again, today is another new bike day. It's like uh, a new birth in the family. Oh, hello. It's like welcoming a new child to to the world, to to the house. There's there's too many bikes in the house now. There's too many. But you know, there's pros and cons. I think it's always good to get new bikes. Anyway, please give a warm welcome to the new member of the family who I'm gonna, I'm just gonna wheel into this space behind me, and uh, and we can have a quick look. She is. Check that out. You got sharks, pigs, lucky. This is a rigid mountain bike from the 1990s. Uh, I, I got it off eBay again. And it's got no suspension. It's rigid. It's, it's, it's really quite heavy. It's really quite heavy. Um, but yeah, look at that. It's a track attack professional. That's what it says on there. Track attack professional. And it says, I'll, qu I'll, I'll give you a quick look. Supplied by Discount Warehouse, Hatherley Gloucester, Hatherley Road, Gloucester. There we go, look at that. Yeah, I'm not sure what happened to the seat post. The seat post. I have adjusted that seat post to be my height, but it's got like these big dents in there. And it looks like when you tighten up this clamp, the frame actually digs into the seat post and makes dents in it. So I'm not sure what's going on with that. There's a few jobs I've got to do on it. Have you ever seen a dirtier chain than this? I don't know if the GoPro will focus on that. That is super disgusting. I think that's what happens. That's what happens in a, with a maintenance regime where you just go out for a ride and just put another layer of you just put another layer of oil on your chain and just ride it. And then six months later, oh it's a quick ten mile bike ride, I'll just put some more oil on the chain do that for 15 years and you end up with this I can't even tell some of these chain links apart they're just joined together with grease and the amazing thing is it still goes round look how smooth that is that's super smooth I've got bikes which don't do that I've got a sticky Mavic free hub on my road bike that won't go backwards that fast with that lack of resistance, that's good. Look at this. Proper legit reflectors, safety first. Not taken off since, I reckon this bike's 1995. That's my guess. But if anyone knows anything about a track attack professional, let me know. Let me know, this is, yeah. What else have we got? We got a triple. We got a triple on the front here. How exciting is that? We've got a massive range of gears. We've got five at the back. Five gears at the back. Used to have one of these when I was, I don't know, 10 or 12. Not this model, but five gears at the back, two or three at the front, I can't remember. 
doesn't even have a um, doesn't even have a dropout like what do you call it? Uh, a hanger it doesn't even have a derailleur hanger. It it has a a bolt-on derailleur hanger. So it's it's actually yeah. At least I can get some mug guards on it. Look, got two mounts, but they're not threaded. Are they threaded? Oh yeah, they're threaded. They've just never been used in twenty something years. Yeah, so 26 inch wheels. I reckon I've just got myself a legit gravel bike. I've, I'm on trend again. Look at me go. I've got a gravel bike now, so I'll make a new video at some point about bringing this back to life. It rides. It does ride. And the gears shift. The guy who I got it off on eBay, yeah, he, he's kept it working at least. But some of the components are horrendous look at these brakes they're made of plastic the, the brakes are made of plastic those these big arms here they're just plastic and 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 you lean on the brake levers and it doesn't really stop very well uh, anyway let's have a look at the handlebars this is a throwback check out this do you remember these shifters I remember these from from the late 90s, mid to late 90s. Shimano SIS thumb shifters. Look at that. Beautiful. Oh. And they actually work. They actually work. Anyway, that's it. That's my new bike. If you know anything about these things, let me know. If you like my new bike, let me know. What do you think I should do with it? I've got a few ideas. Might make a video about bringing this back to life. It's going to take a few days to degrease this chain, I think. One last look at that chain. Oh, that's horrendous. <sighs> anyway, see you again.